Hi, Kayleen West here from Playfessional uh, with another Playfessional Chit Chat. And this is a place where I, I encourage or hope to encourage you in your creative walk and even in just in your walk in life. So um, I bring to you things that inspire me and um, at the time and, uh, you know, I deliver them to you and hopefully they inspire or help you in some way as they've helped me. Now today I would love to speak to you about you, about the authentic, beautiful, original, one of a kind you and how um, who you are correlates to your creativity and what you produce and what you give out of yourself. Now when you think about creativity don't think just art, you know, or just music or just dance or that. Creativity can be found in so many forms. It can be expression. It can be through something you speak. It can be, like, you know, it could be any act that you do, that you take something that's um, unoriginal and develop it further and it produces some kind of um, benefit. So creativity when it's put on something ordinary becomes extraordinary. So I want to encourage you that within all of us, we are capable of so much more, like so much more. And there is so much hidden within us individually uh, that can be um, unearthed and surfaced and bring so much joy to our world. Firstly, I want to touch on individualism. So I believe that each one of us was created for a very individual walk through life. Now, without getting into anything too detail, uh, I just want to touch on the fact that we are all very unique and we're intentionally unique. I mean, we're, we're created uniquely um, through um, just because we are, you know, generic, gener generically, can't find the word, but we are, our, we were formed very uniquely, one of a kind. There isn't, a, a, you know, another one of Kayleen, there isn't another one of you. And we are also um, shaped to some degree by our life's experiences and so forth. And we're shaped by what we choose to accept and take into ourselves and, um, and what we choose not to. So there's a whole lot of reasons why you are just you and no one's like you. And wherever you are at right now, so much good can come from you. And so much creativity can be birthed through you. So I want to encourage everyone, firstly, that you have incredibly um, incredible value and can be an incredible blessing to the world, just as you are now. How you choose to form and grow um, is, is totally up to you and does affect what comes out of you. But who you are even right now um, is someone that's capable of giving out and um, doing things that you know other people are not capable of because they can't copy you. If they can try, but nobody can be just like you. Nobody can be just like me, like exactly like me. So we are mimicking things is valuable as a creative to help us learn and so forth. Um, the true blessing is in being original and innovative. That's where the joy and the buzz is too, creatively. When you come up with things and you, or things come out of you that are completely new, or somewhat new because they even surprise you. So I want you to be really excited about what's inside you that you haven't discovered yet that could possibly come out and be a real blessing to you and others. So individually, we are all different and we were never meant to be the same. We're not meant to copy. We're not meant to try to be like someone else. That actually ends in pain. You know, if I was to try to be exact like someone else, that would just be detrimental to me as it would be for you. So we're not meant to 
copy somebody. We can be inspired by other people, we can admire other people, but we're not meant to put them on such a pedestal that they become, their identity becomes more in the forefront of our minds than our own. So we need to we need to be always looking at ourselves and, and how we can grow ourselves and questioning the direction in which we do grow ourselves. So it's um it's like always aiming for your personal best rather than someone else's personal best. So that is how you win. That is how you kick goals, feel like you've kicked them and feel the reward that comes from achieving for yourself, not measuring against someone else. So that's a really, really important thing to get right into us, right into our spirit to, to know that we are meant to be, you know, Kayleen was meant to be on the date, born on the date that she was born and um, regardless of any situation, how you're born, um, you, you were still brought into being for for purposes. It, discovering those purposes is like an Easter egg hunt. This is my relationship with God, actually. It's a bit like an Easter egg hunt where, <clears throat> you know, there's he doesn't hide things um, away that it's too hard for me to find, but but enough for it's for it to be fun and 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 uh, a um, enjoyable relationship, you know, dis of discovery. So. Creativity is just the same. It, it comes from a place, from a hidden place that you don't know about uh, before it comes out. But unless you actually take action and start doing it, you won't see it. And there's an advantage of being okay with yourself, growing, looking to grow, but being okay with yourself, um, admiring others, but looking and searching for that authenticity and that innovation within you. So today, that's my message to you. Today, be you, celebrate you, and learn to discover more of you, and you will produce more beautiful, better um, things that you can share with others and celebrate yourself. So be encouraged you're wonderful and I think you're wonderful and I'm excited for everything that's that lies within you and um, I just pray that you you go on a journey that helps you bring out the best of what you have to offer and um, that none of it is hidden for too long or hidden long enough that it gets forgotten or is never ever discovered because that would be sad so I hope you enjoyed that. If this was helpful for you, please share. Please encourage others with these messages. If it's encouraged you, don't keep it to yourself. Share it out and um, I will see you next time. Be blessed. See you later.